Wait a minute, why can I... Oh, I didn't switch the thing over. There we go. I was like... Why do I not hear anything? Oh, I didn't switch it over to my headphones yet. Ah. <laughs> oh. Hello, world. I want to do some, uh... Cooking Simulator today. I'm actually going to turn this down as to the smidge. The Cooking Simulator, for whatever reason, is a little bit on the loud side. Alright, I just want to do something fun tonight. Take another break from Terraria and everything else. Uh, tomorrow, we'll be continuing with... Uh, Gun Club building with the real grade for Simples Gundam, just to uh, put that out there. Now, considering that, oh wait, this is, wait, I don't want to start in career mode just yet. Go back. Yes. I just want to go into like the sandbox mode for a little bit. I'm going to start in the chill mode where I don't have to. I'm going to start out with this deal. Um, yeah. Uh, regarding the Gunpla Live building here. Now, there is nothing that's been kind of I'm aware of going on with Twitch today. Apparently, um, there's been a whole lot of DMCA stuff happening on Twitch lately. And it's mostly from the MPAA and the RIAA. Uh, copy striking, striking clips and stuff from uh, various YouTubers who have uh, fixed your videos and whatnot. I don't think I'm in any trouble with this because I don't try to use vocal uh, popular music in any of my streams. I try to stay away from that because I know that stuff will get, uh, get into a bit of trouble. Now regarding the video game music, I don't know, kind of up in the air. I don't think the MPAA is really involved in too much of a video game music, unless it's stuff that has vocal, vocals in it. So I guess I should be okay. But but for tomorrow's stream, I am going to have to kind of carefully consider what I'm going to use as background music for it. So, um, but I'll try and figure that out by tomorrow. Do that here. Um, anyway, with uh, Cooking Simulator, I want to try out a few things. Since the last time I played, I've tried thinking about what can I possibly make in Cooking Simulator that would work, or probably would work. And I tried thinking about a few different things here. I have a few things I want to try out. So I may go to career mode later, but I kind of want to try something out here. I was I off stream last time I played. I tried making macaroni and cheese. I didn't show it on the stream. And it came out like macaroni and bees soup. So you can't really make mac and cheese in the game. But, you know, after that, I got to thinking. And I make French toast. Thinking about it, I was like, hmm, it might be possible to toast. So. <clears throat> we start off today. We're going to try to make some French toast here. Uh, first, I will need bread. I know there are loads of bread. I've seen them. Right here. Look for bread. I'm going to take it to the cutting board. I will need some eggs, obviously. Make it a bowl. <coughs> okay. You get a bowl. Can we get the bowl without breaking it? Yes! Okay. Need some eggs. Are down here. A couple of eggs. I will need some milk. Now, basically, from here, you could just make French toast. It'd be a very plain French toast, but you could still make it with what you have right here. But I like to jazz it up a little bit. 
got here. Don't want pepper. See what seasonings we have. Sugar we do need. I need there. What else do we have? Curry. No. Uh, actually, yes, we can use that. I want to see if there is any cinnamon. Cinnamon goes really good. Toast. Cinnamon. Okay, so the cinnamon, a little bit of nutmeg, the sugar, milk, egg, bread. And we are going to just use the, the griddle right here. A plate for my French toast chicken. Uh, needs to need something to hold the mixture. The pail of pan down here. Let's use the castle. I think I'm out. For it. And we'll need the blender. A good job for the blender. Up here. So, egg. To crack the egg. Ah, not like that. Like that. Shells. And we're going to put some milk in here. That's all the good. A little bit of sugar in there. I want it nice and thin the money. Thin the money. Cinnamon, and we just want a touch of nutmeg in here. Don't want to. Pull that together. Yes. Okay. That is our little egg mixture. Just carefully over here. Little. Whatever, I'll just set it right here. As you know, I'll put my bread on it. I slice up. Oh, somewhere. Okay. Bread. Slices of bread. Want an in piece because in pieces don't work too well for French toast. Get like a few pieces here, maybe four. You can just eat that away, we don't need that. Piece, two pieces, three pieces. Should be good. Four pieces of bread. Turn that griddle on. And what you want to do is you want to put this in the mixture. Too long. The other side. Yeah. Doesn't really look like it's absorbing any of the uh, mixture. But that's kind of how you would do it. 
And once it's like nice and good, you pop it on the uh, griddle. Not like that. Just do this real quick here and get all of these in here. Blah, 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 blah. Good enough. On the thing. This is like already cooking really fast. No. It's like so hard to get stuff to just lay flat. Okay. And this is getting kind of done already. going on with my thing here. Huh? Getting getting kind of overburnt here, but uh wait we got we gotta reject. We gotta reject. Ah. We're burning. Okay. Got to turn the grill off. Okay this piece of French toast is uh more. This piece might still be okay. That should be okay. Okay, okay. Get up here. Just the wrong thing. I don't know why they have to make using a specialist so hard in this game. <laughs> Alright, that, that works. Good enough, good enough. That, that'll do. Two out of four. Two out of four. Okay. So now we have our French toast. Now we we don't have any like powdered sugar or syrup or anything. I don't think so. I think the answer to that is. Put honey. That's not really the same. You, you want to have some maples, good old maple syrup on there. Maybe some powdered sugar. Maybe. Tell you what, we'll put we'll pretend that the honey is maple syrup. That's good. <laughs> it kind of went everywhere. You know, just, just to do a touch of sugar. Out of sugar. Okay, there we go. French toast. French toast, the cooking simulator way. Take a nice, nice picture of my toast here. French toast. Dish. Oh, what is that? Can't analyze the dish. Alright, anyway. French toast. Good. Eat. Okay. So what else should I try to make here? If 
thing I gotta press the right button for things here. Alright. So I was thinking about this also the other day. What if I make something that I wouldn't normally ever try to make? I tried thinking about it a little bit here and then I thought about, hmm. You know, there's this place called the Heart Attack Grill. They make obscene amounts of high calorie food that nobody in their right mind should probably try to eat. I figured, okay, what if I try to make a Heart Attack Grill? No, I'm not. A massive hamburger. I'm gonna take two, three, four, five. Wait, there's more. We're gonna do six. That's six. <laughs> Got an achievement for that. <laughs> Let's start to try that again. Don't worry, they're still good. I'm gonna do a six patty hamburger. It'll be excellent. Excellent. We'll use uh, the, the grill over here. Make that nice and easy here. Hey. Actually, no. I want some... We're going to make this burger ex extra special. going to make it a bit extra. We're going to include a couple eggs in there. And some bacon. Got to have bacon on. Gallops. Need our cheese. And goat cheese as well. I'll just put that stuff over here. I want the goat cheese. What else do we want? That's probably good. Uh, we need our usual assortment of salt and pepper. We're gonna put that all over the burger patties. Doubt and pepper. Oh, and salt. I also like to use a little bit of garlic powder on burgers too. I think it was garlic powder, let me check. Oh, that, that sounds interesting. Yeah, garlic powder. Okay, let's use some of that. Well, I'm actually going to make this kind of like a McDonald's style. We're going to have a bun in the middle, too. I do need to cook my eggs. Cheese over there. Throw my bacon on. I'm gonna try and do as much on here. Actually, you know what? Just take a whole thing. Take a whole thing. I'm going to try and do as much on here as I can. Two eggs. There. Don't worry about the eggshells. Just throw them in the deep fryer. It'll be okay.
Keep bright eggshell. It'll be excellent. An excellent source of calcium. Last piece of bacon on here. All right. Burger patties. Let me uh, just kind of move these around a little bit here. Season them properly. Good. Plenty of salt. Part cut. All right. I don't forget we need to toast our buns up too. One here. I'm wondering what kind of veggies are we going to have on this burger? Oh, I'm going to tell you where we are going, we don't need no veggies. Because veggies is a health food, healthy option. They don't do that. They don't do that with this type of burger. Look on that. And let me grab spatula. We are going to want to flip burgers here in a moment. I forgot to... Now, let me get the burger bun off. Or they burn. Eggs are done. Get them off here. It's about done. Might be a little cheating. I'm just going to pause this thing for a second. You know what? I don't think you really need to put the bacon up. It's a pretty thin piece of meat. It'll, it'll cook thoroughly. It'll cook through. What? Place my cheese here real quick. Uh, some slabs of goat cheese. Along with the uh, uh, cheddar. Bacon. Bacon is done. I don't know why tongs are so hard to use in this game. Peace. 
I don't understand how Kong's work game. It doesn't make any sense to me. Like now I can't get rid now I can't get the bacon out out thing. Dude. Kongs go away. They are useless. Need a uh, special that you love. Let's we'll do this. Let's do this. That, that at least works here. It's more consistent. I think is what I mean to say. Oh, what the? Oh, what happened? Ashlo, what did you do? What happened to the plate? It disappeared. Oh, I put that down. The egg down. Like my plate disappeared and now I don't have something to put. My plate ended up phasing through the cabinet. And now my spatula is phasing through the cabinet. Along with the hole. Having technical problems. Plate back. Plate back up here. Plate does not go down there. All of this stuff needs to go back in the plate. The terrible man. What terrible. You know what? You know what? Give me the heat proof blood. I'm, I'm, I'm tired of messing with that. Just give me that. I can actually pick these things up and just put them on the freaking plate. Because by now they would have cooled off where I can just put them on a the plate. Enough of this, my luck. Eat. Burger just need to cook a little bit more. Let me get my cheese. Better the cheese. I don't know if I need all this goat cheese. I don't need that one. And what else do I need? Really, the last time I made a burger, I forgot to put the ketchup and mustard on the burger. This time. We're not gonna put barbecue sauce on the burger. We're not gonna bother with ketchup. There will be a mountain of meat and cheese and egg and bacon. And these are done. All right, they're done. So it is time. Take a large plate. We're going to plate this up. Right here. Start with a uh, bottom burger bun. Well toast. Piece of meat. Bacon. And an egg. Goat cheese. Well, it needs to be on there the correct way. Egg needs to get back on there. Bacon. Do our next piece of beef. If another piece of bacon. I don't know if we can do six burgers on here. <laughs> it's kind of falling apart. Falling apart. I want to stay together. That's a top one. I don't want that. 
Let me hear one. No, it doesn't want to stay together. Well, I guess that's the best we're going to be able to do here. <laughs> the game's physics will not allow you to stack stuff so high. Alright. So anyway. And... I need some more cheese on there, I realize. I need some cheddar cheese on there. Along with the whole bowl. Cheese with a all on there. And the last piece of bacon gets all to stay on here. Stay on, stay on. And pop. We now have our giant burger mess, which is falling apart. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm, yes. Now I want you to just imagine. Imagine that all together as an actual piece of food. As a big ball stacked burger with egg and cheese and bacon. And um, I forgot to put the barbecue sauce on there. I was forgetting that part. But here we go. Barbecue sauce. Now it's good. Now it's delicious. And you know, just... Since the game doesn't want to actually do this correctly, let's just uh, put it all in the blender. And that will fix everything. in there, get our cheese. Since the game will not allow me to make the burger properly, just to throw it all in the blender here. Make a blend. Nice little blend of very unhealthy hamburger. A piece of cheese, I can go in there. Is there anything else missing? Oh, well, there's a burger patty over here. Can't put, can't put that. And while we're at it, let's just put the French toast in there too. And since we're making a special blend, we will add some veggie. We will put chili pepper in there. Just to make it a little spicy. A little spicy. Anymore, we can take that out of there. And to make it well cooked, well cooked uh, mixed burger blend, we're going to put it in the casserole dish. That's good. We have enough uh, material to make some of these.
Oh, I didn't, didn't miss the sink. the game without let me do that fine fine no one way to do it that way i'll just put it in here like this then hi my day is going good can't you tell <laughs> I try this again. Casserole dish. Mixture. Good. All right, let's not not destroy the oven this time. I pressed the wrong button. Uh Okay, whatever. Oh, okay. That's it for making the burger mixture. The game will not, lock, not let me make a stack of hamburger. It won't let me cook the stack of hamburger in the, as a mixture. What else can I make? That is possible in the very specific confines of this game. I don't like food being on the floor. It can be on the counter, but not, not on the floor. All right. Uh, let's do something with vegetables. With the red bell pepper. I like red bell pepper. I don't want any more cheese. I'm with cheese. I'll go in the trash. Well, that's just one bell pepper. Let me see what else I can get here. I'm gonna make a lovely. Vegetable. No, I'm. Uh, maybe a casserole is sort of thing. Let's see what we have here. Parsnips. We don't use parsnips on anything. Bell peppers. Do the lock up. Broccoli now. Broccoli's always good. Broccoli. He's good. Start with this. I wish you could hold the vegetable in place while you're cutting it. You could get some actual proper cuts on this end instead of it just sort of falling, falling apart. Oh, I just cut that. <laughs> To use a giant block, or the payola pan, whatever. Yeah, just put it all in the payola pan. 
That'll work. Peppers and peppers and peppers. The big pepper mixture here. Another piece of pepper there. I don't know exactly what I'm making, but I kind of have a vague idea in my head. It's gonna be a grilled fried vegetable something. I'll probably get some more broccoli because this is not enough broccoli. Oh, you know what it needs? It needs carrots. Yeah, get some carrots in there too. Let's uh, cut oh, this link was. Yeah, I like that. We'll just uh, one chop and half. That works. Cosmic, a little bit cosmic. A little bit of a angle here, be a little fancy. I want the end piece of the parsnip. I need some carrots and more broccoli. Carrots. Three more pieces of broccoli. That should probably be. It'll be like fried vegetable. I'm going. Since I can't really do like fried rice, I'll do like fried vegetable instead. All right, now we do our character. Chop these at a little bit of angle. That work. Pepper. 
houses. Don't need any of that. I think I saw a soy sauce in here. That a soy sauce one. You want a little bit of oil. We have. I see rice vinegar is good too. We can use that. A little bit of that. We don't want too much of that. The choices are. I guess sunflower oil might be the closest tasting to vegetable oil. Let's do that. Actually, white peppers are peppers. He's the name. None of that's really what I Cilantro, like good chives, yes, chives, won't you? Parsley, or is he not good? Mate, man, you want chives, though. Let's get some chives. Bowl here. Um. All goes on the door. Now you would want to chop these up a bit. Freshly chop sides. Nope. Oh, I can do that. Because I don't know if I can still pick them up. The answer is no. The game will not let you cut the chives. Chives are uncuttable. Fine, whatever. But just uh, just throw them in. And all right, that, that's probably enough to get started. Let's put the oil in. Get this uh, I don't need a lot of salt here. Just a little bit. I'm sure your salt's gonna come from the soy sauce. Nice kind of go on there. Soy sauce. You like stir fried vegetables, basically. That's what I'm making. Something like that. They're still a little chunky.
I think that's good. I think that's good. I think it's done. Now we played it up. Uh, it's like a landslide. Landslide of veggies. How many can I get in the plate? Just uh, pick these up and throw them in. Yep. Now you have uh, your fried veggies. <laughs> chunky style. Very chunky style stir fry. vegetables for fry. Alright. Alright, I guess I should go back to career mode now. I guess I had my fun. I think I thoroughly, well, I didn't really thoroughly wreck, wreck the kitchen, but we can always do more. Just, just turn everything on. Turn it all on. Run the power. Anything else I can turn on? Turn the water on. These are broken, so I can't. Re oh yes, I forgot I got fried the egg shells. They are cooking. You know what, we will try the blender too. This ain't getting hot. I guess it is on. No, back here. Actually, a deep fire is a faster way to make this explode, I think. There we go. Deep fried gas. Everybody loves that. It's their favorite. 26, 27 liters of water. Wow. 7, 29, E. There we go. All right. We're done here. Make a bagel with tuna. Well, the problem with that is there are no bagels in this game. And I don't think there's tuna either. Do 
choices of fish or cod, trout, salmon. Oh, wait, there is a tuna. There is tuna. I'll just uh, put the tuna on there for now. You can do like a tuna sandwich on bun. Ah, uh, but there is a piece of tuna. It is not cooking properly. Get it on there. Oh yeah, it's cooking. I do need to plate it up properly. And what should we put on there? I have my salt and pepper. Use honey. Honey will be good. Put honey on there. Let's toast the buns. Okay, I'll toast the buns. Work best on open flame. Flip this around a little bit. Yeah. yeah. There we go. With spices. My spice shall be mint. A piece of mint. That's all the spice you're gonna get. Tuna is a very dense meat. It takes a little while to cook. These these buns are not really uh, taking to the open flame too well. Probably good enough. One, one more piece of mint. Put on there. Good. The tuna does not have to be well done. It can be a little undercooked. We can put some uh, pepper on there. A little bit of salt. Meat or honey on there. A little bit of honey, I don't need a whole lot. And on top of the bun. And there you go. Here's your tuna sandwich. A little bit of mint and honey on it. It is delicious. Oh, that, that exploded instantly. It was that hot. Okay. All right, I need to continue with uh, campaign mode here. Spent an hour fooling around, now I'm going to do an hour on campaign mode. to my kitchen need to do any prep everything's where it was before book is on the floor how much does the game cost uh, it's normally about twenty dollars but it's on sale for like 13.99 right now on steam Needs to go in. in. Alright, 
right, I'm just gonna get started here. Hit me with what you got. Yeah, it's actually a pretty fun game just to mess around with. Mess around with. You can get a hold of it. Ham and steak and boiled potatoes. Let's go ahead and get the. Okay. Get a couple of potatoes right away. Out. Piece of salmon. Technically, I'm learning at the same time as I play. Well, sort of. Um, I mean, I cook pretty decently in real life. <laughs> this is actually a lot harder for me. As there are things I can't do in this game that I want to do, that I can't really do in this game. So it gets kind of. Like, using a spatula or tongs is like incredibly difficult in this game. And it's like the simplest thing to do in like real life. What am I doing? Salmon. Season salt. Uh... Are almost done. Good. See, the salmon is supposed to take 60 seconds on each side. It's already been a little bit here. Hmm. Well. Oh, that's not really a thing you can do in, the, do in this game. Uh, spatula. Wait, right there. <laughs> well, let me cut this first down and get the plate. Why won't you go on the spatula? Come on. You know what I mean by it's actually easier to do some of this stuff in real life than it is in this game. Like, tools are so hard to use. Not this hard in real life. I just want to flip with it. That's all I want to do. Flip. That's not even in the pan correctly. The other way. There we go. That's what I want to do. All right, sixty seconds. Now go grab a plate. I should be good on time. Yeah, I got plenty. Those potatoes really aren't cooked all the way. A little bit more. 
Actually, the salmon is done, actually. I'm not, I'm not gonna keep going, that's already done. Oh, the taste is off. Temperature was perfect. Technique. Technique on the salmon was off. Okay, whatever. What? What is that? This is pork chops, potato. Right in the pan. Save me a step. Thirty power. Little, 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 little bit more. Little bit more. Ninety second pizza. All right, need a couple potatoes. Pumps gonna go on a baking tray. I need to season these. They need to be seasoned. This has got to be flipped. Ah, uh, come on, why is it so hard to flip things properly? Come on. There we go. Salt. How much salt? It's good. I didn't put a little extra. Extra, go in the oven for 80 seconds. Uh, 
the plate. Do a large plate. And now I get to wait a little bit. I take a drink of wonderful carbonated beverage. Not exactly done, but. I guess we'll go with that. Oh. That didn't seem like it's cooked all the way though. That's the way they want it. They're, they're pleased. Salmon for like unwanted. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> how, did, how did I get salmon in there? I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, I know it was like a smidge, a smidge too much sunflower oil, but salmon. Where did you get salmon from? Is it like re residual taste in the pan? I just can't think for the potatoes. Like, I don't know what the correct way to cut, cut the potatoes is. Like, if this was real life, I could probably cut them very nicely. But in this game, there's just not a way to do that. Cutting is very awkward, this game. Grilled tuna steak. Ooh, we got tuna. Okay. We need a lemon. Oh, there's two orders in here. All right, well, let's get the um, tuna. Get one here. Salmon. Grab tuna and salmon. And we need lemons. How many lemons do we need? 80 grand. That's just one lemon, okay. Potato. The one or two potatoes I need. Two potatoes. Right. And those just have to be boiled. That started. I need twenty. Maybe assault. Hey, easy peasy. 
I have tuna. I think those are roughly the same, aren't they? Yep. Tuna's gonna be grilled. Salmon, I'm gonna go in the pan. 60 seconds each. A little bit more. A little much. A little much. Ah. Show taste of some power. Yeah, those potatoes are not done, but whatever. And this is going to go on the grill. Grill. Here. And how long? 80. Which is 20. Alright, I need to get some plates. Uh, we're gonna need an oregano twig. Oregano. Uh, oregano. Keep misplacing my spatula. There we go. At that time. I don't know what the time was. One minute. Yeah. Alright, I think we are doing good. This I was eighty seconds. I need a second plate for Ham in it. It's cool. Uh, tuna goes with lemon, salmon goes with pickle. Oh, it's done. It's yeah. okay. Time. They do not want time. How is time getting in there? Pork chop. It tastes like pork chops. Why does my salmon taste like pork chops? <laughs> added flavor. Uh, 
Did I just drop a piece of lemon? I did. <laughs> Stay on the plate. Now that was excellent. Taste of oregano. Wrong amount of product. <laughs> what? Bah. We're done. We're done for today. Apparently these plates have got like stuff in them. That's salt and pepper, it's fine. Give her this soup. Yeah, sure, okay. Oh. Whoops. Looking at looking out of my screen. What could do that? Apparently, I realized you can stack dishes over here. I'm just gonna grab a few and stack them over here as I need them. There's a couple. It's perfectly okay to leave all the sour cream out here. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Alright, that's probably... good. We're done. 13.30. See Uh-oh, food critic time. Oh, not quite level up. Take a lot of orders for baked trout. That is the special today. So why don't I just get some uh, big trout ready here? We'll get a couple pieces of trout. Keep these on hand. Right here. That's good. And I'm gonna get some potatoes because I seem to go through potatoes a lot. That's probably good enough to start. Hit me. Mato. And sixty to me. One twenty, two forty, three sixty, four eight. 
six, seven, twenty, nine, forty, sixty. Hang on a look. Let me get my other pot for the, uh, with that pot. Pot needs to have 700 of chicken broth in it. That's enough here. grams of the cayenne pepper and eat and oh that was a little much a little much Blend and add sour cream. Put those into a deep plate. Well, I have one right here. Oh, that's that was all I have. A little bit more. Now I'm not gonna throw this stuff away. If somebody else orders the uh, maple soup, I will still have some on hand. You make the best tomato soup. <laughs> Perfect. Food critic is here. What do you want? Big trout. Anything below four stars will not pass. Take 200 grams of the trout. 
And what are we cooking that in the baking tray? Okay. Five five uh earth diamond bill. Okay. I'm drawing I got plenty of time. I got like six minutes. Get in there. Get in there. Go in. Alright. Uh, lemon quarters. Did not grab lemons. You get five pieces of lemon. And we're gonna garnish with parsley. XG of parsley. The plate. Oh, we got the horseradish. Right there, don't forget. Two twenty. Well, that's two twenty C. That's not fair. But yeah, it is pretty hot. That that's almost like four hundred Fahrenheit, something like that. Five D of horseradish. Good. Got our lemons. Oh, oh, don't do that. That is everything. Enjoy. Perfect. Oh, almost perfect, but I did really, really well there. Oh, I forgot the parsley thing. That's why. <laughs> parsley. But otherwise, I did pretty good. Yeah, it's a new level of thing. Right, what do we got here? Steak and fries. <laughs> On the plate! On the plate! Hundred of potatoes. That's uh, two potatoes. Two potatoes. Take it. Oh, pepper. Fried. So by fried, and I mean pan fried. I assume. 
Soon. Now a little bit. A little bit too much. Yeah. 45. Six G. Special. Okay, these are going to go on a deep fryer three seconds. The, I don't know why the fryer oil looks kind of weird. Adapt. Made a rose from big. It was going everywhere, it doesn't want to go on the plate. Uh, get the things out. Get out of there. No. This is like too many potatoes, like everything's trying to come off the plate. There you go. Not the best effort, but you'll have to do. They, they still kind of enjoyed it. Eh? You seen the rosemary? I put rosemary on there. What are you talking about? What is this thing? Alright, this guy wants salmon and boiled potato. Oh, we got another tomato thing, okay. Luckily, I have that ready already.
switch my potatoes over here. Oh, that was too much. Too much pepper. Too much pepper. <laughs> oh, too, too much. Fifty seconds. And this stuff is gonna warm this stuff up a little bit. to go into a deep blue. Why do you do that, Salmon? There we go. Alright, here's your uh, soup. This, this is reheated soup. And you know what? It's still good. Thanks. All I need for that. What else is here? Another big trout. Salmon and a toad. Oh. Hmm. Still not good enough. Non assault. Eating mistakes. Fuck. Oh, there's another order for trout. In that case, let's just do uh, two trout too. At the same time. Okay. I'm running out of places to put stuff over here. Getting like stuff all over the place. Yeah. Here.
All right, big trout. Petrothyme bill. And loot it to there. Go for ninety seconds. And... Good. And we need lemons and quarters. Need two of them. It does need horseradish on it, on it doesn't it? That over here. Aji of horseradish. Uh, oh, parsley. Keep forgetting that. How much parsley is there supposed to be? Itchy. Oh, uh, no, no. Get back on the plate. What was that? What the? What was that? Everything just exploded off the plate. Stuff does not want to stay on the plate. Why? What is going on? Stay on the plate. Firstly. I think there's a potato in there. <laughs> that still did very good. I remember the parsley this time. Technique. There's just something wrong with my technique. It's, it's just wrong. Oh, okay. The amount of orders is starting to increase here. Yeah. 
me get this organized again. this potato wasted in the bin ah there's a piece of rosemary I figure we'll do one more day and go uh, take a break here. Get rid of this stuff. supposedly has salt and pepper in it, which is honestly perfectly fine for a cast iron pan. It gives it a little bit of flavor. You want a little bit of seasoning baked into it. What, what makes it good? Now I need to get clean my baking tray somehow. I don't know how to do that. Alright, is that good? Oh, there's a way to properly clean this. Is that good with the uh, seasoning? Yeah, apparently that did. It's gotta be clean too. This is what we have dishwashers for. Now I don't know how to get the water out of this. There we go. Now that's clean. Everything clean. It's clean now. Okay. I don't know why there's a stain here. I can't clean that. this a little closer to the big knife you know <laughs> and all right I think we did pretty good today better potato in in <laughs> All right, yeah, I'll go. Oh, went up two levels. The decoration of it.
skills. Okay, what do we want? Six points. Got kitchen decorations. I can make. I'll well make it cheaper now. I haven't broken anything yet. Surfers and gourmets have exploitation so I knew that. What do you want to make next? Do cod. Do some bell pepper with that. Oh, bell pepper powder. Pumpkin broth. Grilled beef duck. I like beef duck. That sounds pretty good. Alright, I'm just gonna get a bunch of potatoes ready because we seem to use potatoes a lot. Six potatoes on on the ready here. Tomato soup is dish. Okay, well we will use a big pot. Where's my big bowl? The six tomatoes, I think, that makes one dish. Forty, sixty, eighty, six hundred, seven forty, nine, about nine forty, uh, up. Seven to make plus seven. That was great. I need another chicken broth here. Go ahead and get that ready right away here. Let's just get started. Steak with french fries. Need a steak. Bottle. Grab an onion. Get there. Ah, uh, four and four.
potato. This one. I'm just gonna cut it this way. This way. Yeah, that works in better. Got to season the potato. All set. Yes, 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 yes. What happened there? Didn't nothing. I were like off center here. There you go. Are we sure that cook long enough? Or... Oh, it's deep fried. Oh, 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 you did that wrong. What are you doing, man? Are you an idiot sandwich? Apparently I am. Well, they've been uh, pre-baked. They'll be even better. Will be even better. It'll be the best fried potatoes ever. And we need a plate with frozen red. I'm gonna get a bigger plate this time. So last time I did this, this stuff kept falling out for the plate. I saw that little maneuver there, plate, and I commend you. That was very tricky, and you did it pulled off very well. All right now, I just want to get these. Uh, Oh. No, no, no. What are you doing? No. I just want to grab these potatoes, but it's so hard to get them all on the plate. Because there's just so many of them. Yeah. Down. There we go. And we need tinge or rosemary. Uh, moving around. The stuff just falls off the plate. Why does it do that? It moves on its own. But it came out pretty good. Here, please. Bad cutting technique. <laughs> They're probably a little bit overcooked. 
ですか Chop and okay, now we're baking the potatoes. Six G assault. Quickly, let me raise my, raise my thing over on top of it. It still seems like a lot of it.、Uh, 80 seconds. Nobody's ordered the tomato soup. Onto a plate. Again, I'm carving into the big plate. This might be here. I got all these potatoes. Potatoes will be nice and crispy. I'm tempted to try and put these in the blender. Would they blend? All the bronze. Waste so many potatoes. Guess I'll get some more potatoes. 
to seem to go through them. I feel like the boat shop's gonna be a little bit overdone. That's trout. Now I'm gonna want some lemon and trout. Cutting technique. Salt. Ah, oh, there's tomato soup. Lime, dill, and pepper. Cool. 
My best dish is the tomato soup. Wrong amount of product. Well, so you got a little bit extra. on it. Oh, or Spanish. Parsley. Say this is yes, that is perfect. That's as I said, perfect. All right, now I got steak with fries. You uh, clean my pan out. Potato. We're gonna be deep fried. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. It's going to be very thick french fries. Then I'm going to get a big plate. As big a plate as I can get. Dodge. Rosemary. Yeah. Go. 
Now you should be happy with that. Good. Good. Bad coins make on the price. Why do you know what? Do try cutting french fries with these awkward controls. I need salmon. Salmon. And that's just two potatoes and salmon, so like regular plate. Oh no, I'm doing pretty good overall. It does get a little, a little bit hectic when you got multiple orders, you gotta kinda of juggle them. I'm getting I'm getting better at flipping stuff. It's still unintuitive I would say. There we go. Let's send a minute here. Well, it's almost done. Give it a second. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. No. Grab the, grab the potato. There we go. No! Get on the plate. There is your, there's your food. What is he like? Nikki, look at me. I don't know salt. Eating with the weather. 
Wow, after all, you didn't mess that order up. Okay. Right. Well, so much for the uh, tomato soup. Only one person ordered that. Down the drain it goes. Let's just organize my stuff here again. It's perfectly safe to sit and out. I need to clean up a little bit. Yes. Stuff over. But some of this stuff I can't seem to clean. Like this black smudge, I can't. You know what? I'm gonna switch the put my pan over here. Up here. There we go. Okay, uh, I guess that's probably it for today. Still advancing, still doing pretty good. Keeping up. I have not destroyed the kitchen yet. Yet. I haven't destroyed it yet. level up to another perk. Let's see, what do I want? You know what? Let's just have unbreakable bottles. Really be fine. Be skill point. I guess should pay more. I just do fame protector. What a recipe. Pod. Build. Keep them. Potato. I need to say grubs. Pod. What is due to cod? 
easy enough. All right, but I'm I'm going to stop there though. So still a fun game to mess around with. I'm not going to continue with this. All right, that is it for cooking simulator for today. Perhaps another time. I think about some other things I might be able to actually cook in the game. Until next time. Bye bye.